Hi guys, welcome back for another video. Special K here. So I'm back with an um, long-awaited hair update. It has been a year since I've updated you guys on my hair and so much has went on um, with my hair in that year. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to include pictures, um, different things that I'll be doing to my hair this year, all that good stuff. So let me just start by saying 2013 um, for me as far as length was not my year. Um, I did get the length, but I have been crazy obsessed with uh, healthy looking, well not even healthy looking, healthy ends, period. I've been obsessed, you guys, like seriously. Obsessed. Hi, my name is Kendra and I'm addicted to healthy ends. So um, for me, on my quest to healthy ends, of course, I picked up the scissors three times. I cut my hair three times um, last year, trying to get those healthy ends that I desire and also trying to fix um, the deep V in which my hair grows. Um, if I know, if I would have known then what I knew now, I would not have cut my hair. Um, I would have just boosted the protein on the ends of my hair. Uh, just give it a little bit more strength being that they are the oldest um, parts of your hair. So yeah, I would have did that, but you know, I can't you know, I can't um, fix it now. I've already cut my hair. So now on the other hand of 2013 not being my year as far as length, it was an amazing year for me as far as health of my hair. I have never ever seen my hair this healthy. My ends are great. Like I am in love with the health of my hair and I know that they say with healthy hair comes the length so I do feel like I will get the length this year but I was just so ecstatic to um, finally have a healthy um, head of hair uh, even though I'm not bra strap length um, I'm barely maybe armpit length maybe um, so yeah I just I was just really really excited to get that health in my hair uh, Last time I updated you guys, I, it was after a six month stretch and this was my hair after a six month stretch. I felt like my hair wasn't getting the most out of the six month stretches. So I decided to cut my stretches down from 12 weeks to 16 weeks. I um, relaxed my hair. And I also feel like with the shorter stretches, I'm able to babysit my ends more than I was when I was stretching longer. I don't know what that's about, but... Um, yeah, I'm able, to ba I'm able to babysit my ends. I got two inches away from mid back lamp, but like I said, I was trying to fix that V, and I desired healthy ends, so I cut that. Um, and I'm actually coming to the realization that my hair grows in a V. I can't change it. I cut it three times, and each time I cut my hair, it's grown back the exact same way. In that V, that's the way my hair grows. I, I've said before that it's something I have to embrace, but really I mean it now. It is something that I have to embrace. I'm not going to um, keep cutting my hair, trying to get this blunt cut and all of that. You know, my hair just grows the way it grows. And as long as my ends are great, I'm going to continue to let my hair grow. And they don't even have to be great. As long as they're not ragged, split, and just unhealthy, I will hold on to them. Um, I am fully text lax now, so I'm going to also include a picture of that in here. Um, I absolutely love the texture of my hair. I love the thickness, like I said, from roots all the way down to ends. Um, I'm, I'm going to probably try to do a, rock, a wash and go. Uh, if that comes out right, of course, I'll share on Instagram and maybe do a video if it comes out right. So the last time I relaxed my hair, which was four days ago, this was my hair. And as you, as you all know, like I said, I am text like so this is not my uh, accurate length, but you guys can see the bounce, the body, my ends are looking wonderful. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm really, really happy with my hair right now as far as uh, health of my hair. Now, um, being that I did not want to flat out my hair, what I did was I did a roller set. I took the rollers out, wrapped it up. Um, and then I wrapped it up for a little while. I did the ceramic silky, uh, not ceramic, the silk wrap. I did the silk wrap. I took it down and then I did a cross wrap to get my hair straight like this. And um, I noticed on that picture, looking at it earlier, I have about, what, 
just a snip, uh, just a little tiny bit to cut off at the ends if you could see that picture really clear. Um, so as you all can see, I'm at four or five. Um, and that brings me to what I'll be taking this year. I'm going to update you guys better this year as far as my hair. Um, I'm going to be taking Hairfinity for one year. Um, I'm going to leave the link below. These were $24 uh, plus shipping. I'll leave the link for where I purchased these. And this is a month supply. I'm going to be taking these for a year and give you all monthly updates. Um, I'm going to do an official lint check um, video for Hairfinity. I'm also participating in Hairfinity Challenge, which starts tomorrow, February the 3rd. So hopefully I can get this video up today because tomorrow is February 3rd. Um, so I'm going to be participating in their challenge. I'm also going to be participating in Chanel's Long and Healthy 6 Inches and in 6 Months Challenge. The challenge started um, January 15th, so I'm like 15 days late. But, um, yeah, and I also purchased some bamboo leaf tea. There's tons of benefits to this tea. Um, I saw a few ladies here um, do a review on this tea, so I decided to purchase. If you guys would like to um, see a review, not a review, but um, uh, benefits and my thoughts on the tea, um, just let me know. I'll be happy to do that. So, I'll be taking these for um, 30 days. And I'll be taking these for a year. I might repurchase the bamboo tea. I haven't decided yet. But yeah, I, I definitely keep you all updated. So yeah, this was just a quick video. I hope it was I hope it's not too long. Um, if you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns. Oh, oh, my hair now is a failed three strand twist out. Um, yeah, I tried it last night, took it out today, and yeah, it's just a frizzy mess. But I had to roll with it and um yeah, yeah. So this is just a failed three strand twist out. When I get it, I'll come back and do an update for you guys. Yeah. If you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them below. I will see you on my next video. Bye. Mwah.